The Meta app has changed to Meta Horizons. It now has a bizarre new logo, and for lack of a better term, scrambled where the store and settings are located, as well as the referral codes. Follow along and I'll show you where the store, headset settings, dev mode settings, and referral codes are now found. So the store is now located in the top left of the homepage. It looks like a shopping bag. It's not too hard, but if you're not looking for it or you don't recognize the icon, you might get lost. When you click on the icon, you can click on the quest drop-down list to show three categories for the generations of meta headsets and the games they support. You can also search for games by clicking on the top right magnifying glass. Clicking the X goes back to the home screen. Clicking on the controller with Wi-Fi signals coming off of it brings up the individual headset app library and headset settings. You can also pair a new device from this menu as well as clicking the controller plus button. I'm sure, <clears throat> I'm sure it's supposed to be a headset, but it do look like a controller. Plus initiate casting so the phone sees what the headset user is doing. As before, you need to turn on your headset to access headset settings. It's kind of ridiculous, but Meta has reverted debug mode back to developer mode. I don't know why they went with debug mode uh, before. It's, it really is just silly. You can pair controllers as well. Nothing else has changed. Now here's the really silly part. And when I say silly, I mean really effing dumb. To get to your account settings, and that's like subscriptions, headset, game referral codes, you need to click on your avatar profile picture on the center bottom of the main page of, of the app. Then in the top right, click on the three horizontal lines. And there, as we go, you'll find this. So the quests shows you active meta quest quests for cosmetics. Events show you all active and future live events like hollow concerts or hot ones live theater viewings. Saved is your old wish list of games. I don't know why they renamed it, <laughs> but they did. Devices show your headsets as well as give the option to, for pairing an additional headset. Library shows you synced media as well as gives the option of uploading media files, including spatial videos. If your phone is capable of recording those, this is where you go to upload them. Move as if you want to set up the calories burned uh, of how much movement it's. I mean, if you have that kind of app, I'm not sure why Meta doesn't have a smartwatch to, you know, always keep track of your calories and yet whatever. And probably the reason why you clicked on the vid. Referral codes. Why would Meta bury these? Here you can get the $30 headset referral code or click on apps and get the 25% discount for a friend. If they do end up purchasing the game, you also get $5 uh, quest bucks. Oh yeah, like and subscribe, comment if you think the change to the meta app was silly, and I mean my silly. Have a good one, I appreciate you all. And all games you see here will also be in the descriptions. So if you happen to want to help the channel and pick one of the games for a cheaper price, show.